at 11, boat blight has people in one New Haven neighborhood very upset and fed up. It was abandoned on the street weeks ago, and neighbors say the city just won't haul it away. And they brought their concerns to Eyewitness News, and tonight, Channel 3's Hector Molina is getting answers. Living in Connecticut, you've probably seen plenty of boats set sail on Long Island Sound. But someone abandoned ship on Murphy Drive in Fairhaven. According to Rosemarie Bradley Vega, this boat has been in her neighborhood for quite some time. I don't understand why this boat has been on the street for eight weeks. Bradley Vega says she first noticed the boat in September. At first it was on a trailer, but then it was just dropped on the road. So Rosemary called us and told us to come down here and take a look at the boat ourselves. When we came, we noticed that the boat actually wasn't the only thing being dumped. We could see a lot of trash in this area as well. And when I spoke to a local business owner, he said the boat being here is obviously quite odd, but the trash is actually quite common. Jose Vega says the boat is the latest addition to a popular dumping ground. It's a scrap in the, in the side with my business. There's no cameras here. It's dark, no light. Everybody put everything there. Rosemarie thinks the boat's location is why it hasn't been picked up. They really don't care. They should have addressed it. Had it been in the Yale area, it wouldn't have been there one day. She's called multiple city departments, including the mayor's office. She says the person she spoke to said it wasn't their problem to address. As you can imagine, that wasn't the answer she wanted to hear. You work for the city of New Haven. You need to address this. You need to address it with the department that is supposed to be handling this. Well, now they are. Eyewitness News took Rosemary's complaints to City Hall and received this response from the mayor's office. We appreciate Ms. Vega Bradley for bringing it to the city's attention. Staff members from the Department of Parks and Public Works will visit the site in short order and ensure its removal. The mayor's staff says Parks and Public Works should be able to visit Murphy Drive tomorrow. In New Haven, Hector Molina, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Well, you might notice